Hi, and welcome to one of the uh, tips that I've put out for uh, Texas fly casters, actually for uh, anybody that fishes or fly fishes. This, this tip will actually work in uh, regular fishing circumstances, you know, and it's about the Susan Bates knitting needles that I told you guys about in an earlier video, and I kind of teased you about them, and I got in a little trouble for it yesterday when uh, someone just had to know what this was all about, so nothing like a rainy Sunday afternoon to get out and go ahead and, and do a video on these. But this is what they look like, the Susan Bates knitting needles. They run about two bucks. You can get them at Joanne Fabrics. And here's what the tool is supposed to be. This is supposed to be, if it works out properly, we're going to cut these off and you can make a loop in here if you want and, and glue it and tie it. These are what I call knot cinchers. And they cinch your knots, your loop knots, and your leaders, and, and anything else that you have a loop knot that you need to cinch down. These should do the trick. So we're going to take a look. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and go to a close shot on this, and we're going to take a look and see how well these work for actually, uh, like when I tie all my own uh, leaders, especially fluorocarbon and, and salt water, you know, your hands get wet and you can get cut pretty easily as you're cinching those knots. So we're going to try to eliminate that problem with a cheap tool that's easy to make and hopefully works well. Are those knitting needles I was telling you about? I went ahead and cut one loose here and I'm going to leave one kind of long so that I can go back later and tie a little loop into that and hopefully you know, make it a more functional tool that actually has a lanyard or something on it. But that's that one. We're going to use this one for our test and see how this test goes live and online right now. So first thing we want to do is tie a typical loop into our leader material. This is 20 pound fluoro. We got that started right there. Come back here, stick that in there. And not only, it actually works. This is not only does it work, it actually gives you a pretty good grip where you can take this and really, you know, all you got to do is watch for these fingers over here and usually you're wearing gloves. So you, you just cinch it down like that and you've got a really good tool, $2, Walmart probably. Definitely a Joanne Fabrics. I call it a knot cincher. And I'm going to come out with one probably in the next few months that's made out of aircraft aluminum, machined aluminum. I'm going to make on a lathe. But for now, two bucks. Easy to do. Carry that with you when you go and have to tie your own loops and things like that, whether it's for leaders or other kind of knots. And I bet it floats too. Have a great weekend. I hope you enjoyed this tip. And let me know if you've got any ideas or tips about things that uh, you might like to see on Texas Flycaster.